Alrighty guys, welcome back. Today we are currently hopping right into some Nomad Drag Racing 2.0. So we've recently just gone ahead and gotten a new update for it. And uh, as you guys can see, it's quite a big one. Now, I know I'm a couple days late or possibly, yeah, I believe a couple days late, if not one day late, one or two days late. Not too late to uh, gain to covering this update. Um, I was first to cover the Offroad Outlaws update, but I haven't really been keeping up too much with Noma Drag Racing 2.0, so this update really just has come as kind of a surprise to me. Um, but yeah, I'm here covering it now today. Alrighty guys, I figured there would be an update coming sometime soon. Uh, most of the time, Offered Outlaws gets a big update and Noma Drag Racing 2.0 comes right after it. So we are now in update 1.6.0 for Noma Drag Racing 2.0. And we're going to go ahead and go over this list real quick and then hop right in and check out what is new in Noma Drag Racing 2.0, update 1.6.0. Should be fun. Alright, so... First things first, there's a new custom map editor with the ability for custom drag strips and waypoint races. Uh, prepped slash no prep race option. There's a new car, possibly new cars, but I don't really know. I think they just said new car because there's one new car. And for those guys that don't know, it is a 90s model Mustang. So I'm going to show you guys that. It's, it's a pretty cool looking car. All right, being able to add player to blacklist and never race him again. That's, 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 that's pretty cool, you know. I mean... I personally really wouldn't use it, but I guess if, uh, if you get beat that bad, that blacklist is there for you. Uh, I'm just joking. But anyway, so uh, race info screens when joined private uh, race. Uh, stronger brakes in free roam, that's good to know. Uh, RPM slash gear info in replay. Division X tilt bar fixed. Fix for jumping cars in the ville. Bug fixes and security improvements. So without further ado... Let's hop into some uh, Nomad Drag Racing 2.0. We're currently in version 1.6.0. Should be a whole lot of fun. We're going to go ahead and check out the 90s model Mustang first. Uh, I tried the time traveling glitch. And for some reason I think it was patched. I do believe it was patched. Because this is my second take at this video. And I did want to get some gameplay in. Right. For the new 90s model Mustang. I'm just going to show you guys that real quick. This car right here. As you guys can see I do have to wait 13 days. 23 hours. But I've never actually waited that time ever. It doesn't matter if, I've, if I'm on PC or my iPhone. I'll just go into settings. Turn off set time automatically. I've been doing it for years. On multiple different games. And then I'll set, set time manually. And what I did in inst for this instance. Was set it. Uh, you know. 13 days. 23 hours. Not technically, I just said 14 days later, you know, that didn't, that won't change anything except for I'll be able to purchase this car. I buy the car, I change t my time back, that's the, that's the time traveling glitch. Been around forever in Noma Drag Racing 2.0 as well as Offered Outlaws and other games. However, I just tried that and I loaded it back up after closing it all out. And I loaded it back up and it, it just still had 399 or join now, but I glitched the game to the point where this screen didn't even appear. So... I think they may may have patched that, possibly. I don't know, I still haven't tried it on my iPhone yet. But yeah, you guys know the car's in the game right now, so you guys can go ahead and try your t the, time, the time traveling glitch itself and uh, go have fun with it if you are not already a member or purchased it for $3.99. But yeah, sadly no gameplay of it today. I'm going to try to find a workaround for that uh, glitch. And there's no new cars. I don't believe there's no new cars in the retro Oh, then again, there may be because it has been a little bit since I have played this game. But this car here still says 11 days, 23 hours. So I'm a little bit stumped. But there may be new retro cars. I don't know. I don't really keep up with Noma Drag Racing 2.0 that much. Fort Vision X, there's one new car, and it is a members-only car. If I'm correct, this is the new one. And yeah, so that's that. Let's go ahead and hop right into our TRX here. And let's... um. Let's go into free ride. There's something new called events. It's members only and it's going to be coming soon. Race in daily and weekly events against the best of the best. That should be pretty fun. Let's go into free ride here. Single player. And here we go. Here are the new maps. So featured maps. Battle Creek Park and Sin City. Let's go ahead. Let's browse all. Wow. A lot of people. You guys have been making a lot of maps so far. But let's go ahead and check out Sin City. Let's go ahead and rip the uh, the Raptor around, shall we? Not the Raptor, the TRX around. 
in uh, Sin City. Huge, huge city to get lost in, street drags, and a drift course. All right, well, we're going to check this out, and it uh, should be pretty fun. All right, we are now in Sin City. Let's go ahead and cruise around here. I think I have my graphics turned all the way down for some reason, not on purpose. I do not recall doing that, but the graphics look very bad. That might be from me. I don't know, though. Got even all the little prop cars and stuff. This is cool. All right. So there are now custom maps. There's a new 90s model Mustang. The brakes work really good. So those are the improved brakes right there. And you know what? I kind of want to speed around some new uh, some new maps. So I'm going to get into a faster car for this. And I know I haven't checked out everything in the new update yet. But I just kind of want to, you know, uh, maybe, maybe this S10 is fast. Let's, let's find out. Oh, it's not. It's completely stock. All right. Well, we're going to get into an upgraded car. What? I knew something was slow about my T-Rex. Alright, I think I might have glitched something with the time travel because all my vehicles are not maxed out at all. Are not maxed out at all when they were all maxed out last time I was on the game. So that is a little bit strange. But either way, we're going to get this puppy all maxed out. I'll catch you guys as soon as I'm... I'll catch you guys as soon as I'm done with my build. All right, so it's not tuned. Our TRX is definitely going to be a lot faster than than it was before. Now let's go ahead and check out Battle Creek Park. See if we like this one. Now this map here is an industrial park with drag racing, drift course, and an indoor Baja. Should be fun. All right, we are now loaded into the industrial park, and our TRX is a whole lot faster now, which is what I like to see. So now we can rip around and uh, actually have some fun in this thing. Now let's try the improved brakes here. All right, yep, the brakes work pretty good. And for the handbrake, let's do some boosted launches though. Now that our truck is actually maxed out, and it was before, not too sure why it uh, still wasn't, but let's just go ahead and boosted launch here. All right, cooking off the tires still. We gained some traction, we're going 200. And we see 300, probably not, maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, yeah, maybe. All right, 300. And, all right, right into the pole. Yeah, I like these maps. I like these custom maps. Um, but now that we've rode around two of the featured maps, we got to do something real quick. So what we're going to do is, I don't know, I, I guess we crashed the game. All right, that's not very good, but we're going to load on back in. Okay. And I know this game has better graphics than it just did a moment ago. So I'm going to try to uh, change the graphics, you know. Because it uh, seems like it might be on very low setting. So we're going to change it to very high. Or possibly just high, I don't know. I'm pretty sure my PC can handle it, so. Alright, let's go into settings here, graphics. And, uh, whoa, okay, yeah, we want it on high. Dynamic shadows, high. Whatever that is. On. Kind of just darkens everything. But we're going to keep it on anyway. And we're going to do Ultra. Even though I don't have decals. But Ghost FX on Smoke Quality High. Okay. Whole lot better. Now let's go into Free Ride. Oh, it's so much clear. Now let's check out the maps. Now it should be a whole lot clear. Alright, the graphics are definitely a lot better. Still a little bit cartoony. But that, that's okay. These maps are still fun if you don't worry about the graphics, even with everything on Ultra. But, you know, that's okay. Let's go try to try do another 300 mile an hour run here. Get a good, cool angle here. Almost ran over a stop sign. That's okay. And let's keep going. Let's see. 337. 337. Can we do a burnout? Oh, yeah. We can do a burnout right there. Can we do a burnout normally though, just holding the brakes? Nope, that will just do a little bit of a boosted launch. I forgot E is to switch the camera view. Alright, let's give this road a rip. Let's try this road. Or not. Alrighty guys, so that is it for the new update. I do apologize, I was unable to try out the 90s model Mustang. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy it. And uh, you know what guys, the update's out now. I'm just I'm here to tell you guys and just mess around with it. 
So uh, go update your game, go have fun on it, go try out the new car and stuff and the new maps and go make some new maps and stuff. And with that guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy, subscribe if you're new and you haven't already. And with that, make make sure to message guys there night. And with that, catch you guys very, very soon in the next one.